So my buddy Joe needs to bum my flex arm from me again. He's got, I think he's got like 64 pieces that he needs to tap, three quarter 10. It's some uh, pieces of aluminum. He's, he's drilling them now. He's gonna bring them over here and tap them. So I'm just getting the flex arm set up. We got this nice new Cleveland tap here. This is a gun tap and it's the shiny. So it'll work perfect for the aluminum. Got right here. So we'll just go ahead and get it installed in the, in the tap driver there. We'll get a little video showing this thing doing some three quarter tapping tomorrow. All right, so Joe's got all of his parts here. He said you got 78 of these guys. 78. Uh, 60, 61 aluminum. 60, 61 aluminum, coated with infinite quarters, solid stock. The, the gauge height is really handy. It's pretty slick, huh? Yeah. The, uh, the automatic stop on it. Anchor lube seems to be working really good for this too. Anchor lube's working great. Yeah, the, uh, the stop on it is pretty slick because it kicks it into reverse. But yeah, it's making easy work of that, isn't it? No guessing when it stops. All right, so we got 78 of them done in 30 minutes, a little over 30 minutes, 34 minutes, something like that. Not bad at all. So what are you gonna be doing with these guys, just so everybody knows, what are these? So I'm basically using them as a coupling. They're welding to a decorative column at a Christian college, and they're gonna hang banners from the from the rod that will screw into this. So this will weld to the, to the um, structure we're building. We'll screw in a, a three foot long piece of threaded stainless and they'll hang their banners from it. Okay, cool. So that'll be some more uh, work we're gonna use the big flex on for is threading a stainless rod that we got coming up next. We're gonna have a different setup for that, but this is gonna get him going so he can get all the uh, structure welded together now.